<laughs> new information on a sexual abuse investigation at Nicolay High School. The I-team has learned the school board knew about the alleged incident in 1983 but did not fire that teacher. Three months later, that teacher won a presidential award. Ricky Mitchell joins us now with more on this information. Ricky. Well, Carol, the current administration hired an investigator to look into these claims of abuse brought to light in 2016 by a former student. The investigator wrote that he found the student's claims credible. The victim in this alleged abuse graduated from Nicolay High School in 1982. According to an investigation, he told the district that while he was a junior, his math teacher, David Johnson, would pick him up from his home on Saturday mornings and drive to Nicolay's campus. From there, the investigation says Johnson would ask the victim to change into gym clothes and instruct him to do exercises that would result in physical contact between his exposed legs and Johnson's clothed genital area. In 1983, a different teacher called police after a student approached her and informed her that Johnson had initiated sexually inappropriate conduct with him. The investigation says one week later, the district administrator called the teacher into his office and instructed her not to discuss the incident further. Then in a July 1983 board meeting, board members told Johnson not to engage in such conduct again or that his employment would be terminated. Three months later, President Ronald Reagan presented Johnson with an award for excellence in math teaching. The award came with a $5,000 grant for the school. And no criminal cases were filed in 1983 when this information was allegedly reported. But in 2003, Johnson was convicted of fourth degree sexual assault after investigators say he sexually assaulted men in a similar manner he's accused of doing while a teacher at Nicolay. The school now says it wants to hear from any other potential victims. Carol. Ricky, thank you very much.